Welcome back to Forest Farms, everybody. I'm Ivan, and today's Christmas. And for me, it was a pretty good Christmas. As you know, I'm into the Soviet weaponry and the Soviet gear stuff, and I actually got um, a Russian helmet and a PPS-43 parts kit. So, as you guys know, I've been working on my PPSH-41. It's just about weeded out, but before these all dried up, my family got me a PPS 43 uh, Sudeev parts kit. And this one's gonna be interesting. I'm definitely going to have to uh, rely on Red, White, and Blue Buck Slayer, because I believe he's done one or two of these for uh, some of the information that I need. But these are really cool little submachine guns, and I think it's not gonna be too bad. So, if you guys want to come over a little bit, I can kind of run over some of the stuff that came in the, in the, in the parts kit. I kind of have some of the stuff slabbed together at the moment, but it came with a three cell magazine pouch with three magazines and a cleaning kit. Also, it came with, uh, let me, I just kind of was mocking putting this stuff in there. It came with the the bolt I'm gonna have to do some modifications on and the folding stock and you know the spring but this one's kind of a little bit different than my PPSH kit where it only has one part of the shroud and the sight hood um, or the, the sight piece is quite a bit destroyed so it's gonna be interesting because this is gonna be a little more extensive than my last kit a build I think is going to be, especially since there's not really a good way to turn these into uh, striker fired, from what I understand. Most of them have to be hammer fired. So um, let me get this back together real quick. So hammer fired is gonna be a little bit of a different conversion process than what I'm used to. But, you know, it's gonna be a cool project and at least I have it before something crazy happens. But as you can see, the stock normally would fold on the top and you could have a really compact package with these guys. And then when you want to actually use it with more precision, you can fold that, that out and actually have a really cool little tiny handy uh, PDW or little submachine gun. So same thing with the PPSH, the plan is going to be throwing in a 16 inch barrel so I can keep the folding stock and um, hammer fired. I've never done that, so that's gonna be interesting. But if any of you guys have any insight in how to do these well, let me know. I know that this is kind of a impromptu video, but we were out here having a fire and I had my stuff on. I thought, well, not a bad time to actually uh, let you guys see what the next project is gonna be. Um, I'm not sure if I noticed, but it did come with a, I'm not sure if I mentioned it, but it did come with a sling. And it's gonna be very, very fun. So uh, I'll catch you next time on Forest Farms.